I came from the Siemens world, which for most people, the, the transition from Siemens to Rockwell is an easy one. The transition on the other side from Rockwell to Siemens is a, is a more steep uh, climb. And I know that because I, I had a lot of colleagues um, that worked with me in, in, in the same company. Um, and some of them came from Rockwell and they had to learn Siemens and they were all shaking their heads. So they were just like, uh, Rockwell does it like this. Rockwell, why doesn't Siemens? So they were mostly complaining about uh, why doesn't Siemens do it like that? But we're, we were still talking semantic managers. So the old classic step seven, this was pre Tiaport. On the other hand, the people who came from Siemens and went to Rockwell, they say, oh, this is easy. This is very intuitive. So in the beginning, so when I started with, with Rockwell, it's very clear that Rockwell's package was much more intuitive and the, the, the entry level was much was much lower. So especially if you start do we did a lot of motion in that company, especially the motion in, in Rockwell was very, uh, very easy to get started with. In Siemens, you had Simotion as the alternative for motion for, for the motion uh, applications. And Simotion was was just like a, a beast of a of a software package um, with really like millions of possibilities. But that meant you need to know millions of things you need. There were like a par parameter list with 10,000 parameters and but you have to put parameter 5,000 and six and 2309 to, to five. And you just needed to know that. With Rockwell, you didn't have that. The whole motion thing was more like a black box. Whatever happened inside, you just have to send the enable blocks, the move blocks. That was all very straightforward. Um, that all changed quite a bit with TIA Portal because TIA Portal, I, th I think, took a lot, a lot from, from what Rockwell did good and it improved upon it. So now I actually... I mean, I still love working with Rockwell. It's still very intuitive, but I think that Siemens has made huge steps forward where Rockwell has kind of stagnated. Um, on, and the the thing that I'm, uh, where I always thought that that Rockwell lacked is in, in the HMI in the HMI field. So the factory talk compared to the, the WinCC, uh, that's that's for me still uncomparable. Siemens Siemens really beats uh, Rockwell by miles when it comes to to the HMI application. I, I'm, I mustn't say I, I don't have, experience with all the different types of factory talk but but as far as i remember you have to do all the tagging manual manually none of your tags are directly connected to your plc tags um, that was one of the big things in siemens if you change something in your plc the tag gets automatically changed in your hmi 